A homicide investigation tonight at one of LA's largest and most famous apartment complexes. It's the former Oakwood Apartments on Barham Boulevard between the 101 and the 134. Tonight, KCAL Line's Rachel Kim is live in Toluca Lake with the very latest. Rachel. Well, Susie, we are at the Toluca Hills Apartments, but like you said, it was formerly known as the Oakwood Apartments. It provided temporary housing to child actors and to up and coming stars in Hollywood. Singer Rick James lived here and was found dead here back in 2004. Well, tonight, it's the scene of a murder. The entrance to the second floor of the parking structure at the Toluca Hills Apartments was taped off to people who lived there as LAPD robbery homicide detectives investigated a murder. They searched the structure and watched security video in the guard shack for clues. So usually it's very quiet. I love this place and I'm surprised. The LAPD says around 1.30 p.m., they found the body of a 30 to 35 year old man on the ground in the parking structure. He had died of a gunshot wound. Police say no one saw the shooter and they don't know right now if the murder was gang related. I was out for most of the day and on, when, I, when I came back here, I heard the bang. I didn't expect it to be a gunshot or anything like that. I thought it was like a car backfiring. I just saw a woman crying and screaming and really, really screaming and like. 30 police officers all around, so I was like, what's going on? Robbery homicide detectives didn't provide a lot of details tonight, but an LAPD source tells me the victim was an Armenian gang member who was executed and that this murder is related to another Armenian gang murder being investigated by another LAPD unit. When we arrived, we saw this group of upset men talking to detectives. One of them said that he heard the gunshot and then said this. I asked the men if they knew the victim, and one of them said yes, but everyone else refused to talk to us. Now, the coroner arrived about an hour ago, and the investigation continues at this hour. The LAPD expected to release more details tomorrow.